I tried this one yesterday and okay, so here is my honest assessment of the birthday cake. It was too much for me to eat the entire brownie in one sitting. So I cut it in half. I had one one day and one the other day. It was very sweet. It was a very rich. I thought it was good. Um, it does have some like processed, like, I don't even know what's in here. Sugar alcohols. It has sugar alcohols, which I could taste in the beginning. And then as I was eating them, I couldn't taste them anymore. So I'm going to try a different flavor. Let's try the peanut butter candy crunch. So I want to show you the size of the brownie and then kind of like, I know the wrapper is loud. I'm sorry. This is the size of the brownie. It's a square of like an inch and a half. But like I said, it was really, really rich. But let's try it. Sometimes I see people heat these up. I'm going to try it without being heated up. Now, obviously, I could just use it with my hands, but I think using it with a plate and a fork makes it more dessert-like and kind of slows down the eating, but I'm talking too much. I'm sorry. That is a good flavor. Basically, chocolate and peanut butter in a cake. That's what it tastes like. So final verdict on these things, now that I've had two of them, is that... They're a good source of protein. They're a good-ish dessert if you probably cut them in half like I'm cutting them in half. The the other, the ingredients, I'm, I'm not a real big fan of all of the ingredients. 